Hey, what's up? This is D-Money again, and um, today I have a kind of how to play a sniping, or how to play as a sniper on Rundown, and it's Search and Destroy, and I'm going to be talking about various things from sniping, and especially in Search and Destroy. Uh, one of the biggest things of Search and Destroy is pre-fire, which really I don't do any of in this game. Uh, mostly just because I'm throwing throwing knives and stuff because I was recording and just felt like doing random stuff. So, um, and right here, starting off, see I missed a quick scope there. And the biggest thing is, you don't always have to use a sniper. I mean, right here, I mean, look. Look what I'm doing. I mean, call it newbie, call it, I don't even know what you want to call it, but it's part of the game. Um, it wouldn't be smart to use the quick scope there. I mean, I wouldn't even start to use a sniper. There's no point. Right there. Uh, it just wasn't smart. So I used the magnum, sprayed a bit, worked out. Here's my boy Con Man. Nice quick scope there. And you know, I mean, you see in the montages, like, you know, oh, these nice snipers, nice sniping clips. Right here would be kind of one of them, quick scope. I mean, that's lucky. There's no skill to that, really. I mean, there's some, but... I mean, I have steady aim on, stopping power inside of Ant Pro. I go back and forth between Ninja Pro and steady aim, because... And also, I have a single Magnum here, which tends to work out, and I usually use uh, a combo USPs, which tend to be nice. And really, if you want to play good, you're going to have to... Just be experienced in search and destroy. I recommend that's all I really play. Just because I like the game, I like the, the competition. <clears throat> I mean, look, th run down. Three places you can come from, there's three bridges. There's only, I mean, you guard those bridges effectively, you're, you're golden. I mean, right there, I heard him. I have turtle beaches. You know, I mean, they help a lot, especially in search, though. And I mean, okay, if I had missed that shot, I wouldn't have, like, tried to, like, no-scope him or anything like that. I would have, I mean, found out where he was. Magnum, I don't know. This is a fail. See, so I tried to go for the two, got a little greedy. Doesn't work out all the time. Looks kind of cool, though, with the smoke. And, uh, see, so yeah, I know they're in there. Two of them, I went for them. At least I got one back. And, uh, another thing would be to use the map. See right there, I just looked to see where the bullets were on the map. Press start, you just see, you can see the dots. I'm last left, I think. Missed that shot. They know where I am, so you have to move position. I mean, you... That was kind of nice. I mean, you know when you shoot, people, you know, if they, you know where they are, you know they're, they're going to be rushing you, because you're the last one left. And, uh, see, I was over there. Around and I choose a different position to get to the bomb because I knew that uh, they'd be looking for me. That was kind of stupid, but and I can't find this guy. I end up dying. He's behind me. I had no idea why he went over there. So this is kind of a fail. But uh, you know, you just like see this guy. If I, I don't know. I mean, you just gotta move your position right after you snipe, and then if you do it correctly, you can like get people to rush you and then they'll rush and they won't know you are because you switch positions so you can kill them easy and uh I mean right here this is just not looking up I wasn't looking over here I got thermal you can't really thermal works out with, once in a while a couple maps wasteland run down I don't recommend it at all thermal just the scope is not good doesn't work. Right now, I think I... This is kind of campy. I'm not real proud of this. It's kind of nice. You hear them. I mean, you know if they're not rushing across the bridge, they're going to rush you from the left side. And if all your teammates die from the left side, obviously they're coming that way. Last one left here. Get a nice snipe. Immediately change my position. To try to... I hear this guy actually. The next guy that I kill. 
get a little lucky. That never works. That's why I don't prefer the intervention. Uh, I like the really, I tend, I don't know why, I just miss a ton of shots of the intervention. Like, regular hard scoping shots I miss, just because, I don't know what, what it is, but it seems like there's a lot of movement in the scope. And also, it's just, I just don't like it. I can't, I get a lot of hit markers, I get a lot of, I just get a lot of, uh, weird stuff in the intervention, just missed shots, so I use a 50 gun mostly. This is just camping for a kill, I don't know why I did this. Just because I wanted my teammates to do some work. And see there, I counter UAV. Uh, hold on. I mean, I just get owned here. It's nothing said. I don't know why you'd have a shot down a sniper class, this kid, but, uh... I don't... I mean, the fast swap of a handgun is really where it's at when snipers. See here, I mean, counter UAVs are so valuable. I mean, when you're using a stopping power class, people rush care packages in search and destroy, and so care packages they give you away your position. Just counter UAVs are so effective because most people have stopping power, and it can really help out your whole team. I mean, they they don't they don't know where I'm shooting from. So I mean, just get that UAV counter UAV predator. I'm out.